What is going on, everybody? My name is Bear Rich. Welcome back. Episode number three of my path to power. Picking up from where we left off yesterday, we are finally here on FIFA 21 itself, no longer on the web app. We are using our 10 hours early access uh, trial from EA Play. So in today's video, we're going to have some actual gameplay. First off, though, we have our EA member. As an EA member, we receive some rewards. We get uh, a pack. We get a Killian Mbappe Tifo and we get an Icon Loan Reward. So we go and uh, claim those to begin with. We also, we get Eric Cantona in there. We jump straight into squad battles. And this is pretty much what I do for the first two hours. I go and play seven games. I start this one here on professional um, we win that one and I realize the professional was too easy so I upped the difficulty to world class for the next three won those and then I moved my way up to legendary I won two of them and then the seventh game in total I lost um, and I got a bit tilted so I turned it off for the night um, I uh, went and relaxed then I actually came back on and played some uh, pro clubs with the boys went on FIFA 20 um, which was very odd after playing this um, we're trying to get uh, the team to Division 1. Shout out to Darth Wednesday. We also played some Among Us. And after a successful game as the imposter, I went off into the kitchen to grab myself a midnight snack. And I loaded up the companion app on my phone and I realised that I hadn't claimed some of the uh, tier rewards. So I started claiming those, got the, uh, the bear logo and all of that stuff. And um, there was one pack, the level 3 pack, and I didn't really think anything of it until I pressed to open it. I thought, I really hope I don't get someone good here because I won't have caught it on video. Um, and uh, I, I did. And you're going to see now, I packed Mohamed Salah. 90 rated card. Untradeable. I think he is currently valued at almost 400k. 93 pace, 86 shooting. Uh, has the finesse shot and the outside of the foot trait. So... We had to build a team. So what we've done is we've uh, changed that right-hand side. Torreira and Bellerin are on the bench. We bought Ryan Fredericks to play the next three squad battle games. Um, and then we were going to use Trent uh, Alexander-Arnold at right back during our actual Div Rival games. So I went and played three more games of uh, Div Rivals on Legendary. And we also have some packs here. We open this one and we get Barry Bannon, the Sheffield Wednesday legend in this pack, untradeable, I believe. So he is in our club for the rest of the year, um, unless we put him into an SBC. Um, I'll go and discard the TFOs and the badges. I know some people really like uh, collecting them um, and keeping them in a club. For me, I hate it when my club is cluttered, so I always just get rid of them. i uh, get a gold player here, but the coins were probably more valuable than he was. Um, we get a rare player here. We get Gossens. That's a nice card to have. He should be good for SBCs. Um, then some more stadium design. And we discard that Manchester United anthem. There was actually, I did this right before uh, Tottenham played Man U um, and uh, beat them 6-1 at Old Trafford. As you can imagine, very happy with that result. Um, I'm not going to talk about the red card because, I mean, okay, I will. I don't think it was fair to send Martial off and not Lamella. Um, I think if you send one off, you'd have to send the other off. I think it would have been fairer to give them both a yellow card. I'd have rather have won that game on merit as opposed to um, because of the red card. I think we would have won it anyway. We were 2-1 up and we were dominating. Um, uh, Hoiberg, pack him there as well. He's been playing fantastically for, for Spurs. So, yeah, and we get a goal song. So what we're going to do now is uh, go into Division Rivals and play our placement games. We're going to slap a maestro on Salah. Try and boost that dribbling, shooting and pace. And hopefully um, we can go ahead and win as many of the placement games as possible. The more that we win, the more money you get. Because how Division Rivals works this year, if you don't know already, is you get a lump sum of coins every time you reach a new division. So the higher up we get, the better off we will be. Because we'll get uh, the lump sum for each division that we're in. This guy... Fairly strong team. Bashwai is dangerous. Lo Celso's good. Regulion and Trent on either side is strong. The Belgium League defence is very interesting, especially with Mata. Mata looks like a very solid card this year. But obviously, yeah, the links to him 
are a little bit difficult. So we get this game underway and we get ourselves off to a fairly quick start. But unfortunately, Salah is offside and uh, that attack comes to no avail. Our opponent then is attacking in this, uh, well, in what is the sixth minute. We manage to intercept, have a little break. Uh, Jovetic trying to outstrength his man, manages to hold it well, plays a nice ball into Odegaard, but I think I played it back to him too quickly. Shifts me away from goal, tried to get it in, and he gets a nice last-ditch tackle. He's then trying to counter, um, but we put a lot of pressure on him. He goes in for a slide, he wins the ball, but our second man comes in and gets it. Nice turn from Guedes, but the ball gets intercepted, and they then begin their attack as you can see they've got two men up we've got our, our back line and our two cdms right there they have their lamb and their ram or potentially wingers i believe they're playing the 4-1-2-1-2 they have them out in the wide positions does a nice bit of passing plays a lovely through ball a par of fails to clear it hamid comes out manages to block it i try to pass it clear here he manages to re-intercept it my player there runs in between the man and the ball then Shane Long manages to miss it. He does a lovely little bit of dribbling with Bashuayi and he smashes it top left corner. And we're behind in the first game. And I was so nervous at this point. Not only because I knew I was recording it, I wanted to make sure I win. So I switched from the 4-2-3-1 that I was using to the 4-3-3 flat. And as you can see here in the 20th minute, Oxley chamberlain plays a lovely ball through into Salah. We do a little ball roll to the outside, cut in on a strong left foot, finesse it straight past Mignolet. And it's 1-1 again and we're back in it. And the nerves are settled slightly. I've never lost my first game, uh, our first online game on a FIFA. And I didn't want this one to be the first one. So I was very desperate to make sure I won this. We do a lovely little piece of dribbling here with Salah, cut the ball inside. Odegaard at the near post, Mignolet with a fantastic save. And we get a corner, play it short to Chamberlain, Chamberlain into Salah. We are patient with Salah. We run to the near post, do a little bit of agile dribbling into Moreno. And with his weak foot, he smashes it into the goal. And that puts us 2-1 up right before half time. As you can see here, possession's pretty even. We've both had three shots. We've had all three of ours on target, but he's only had the one. In the second half now, Trent making a run. We play a ball through into Salah. Salah manages to outpace and outstrength Regulion. Really nice there. He gets a pass into Jovic, but Jovic blasts it straight at the keeper and Mignolet covers up the rebound. He then throws it out too quickly and Moreno, our left back, manages to win the ball. Odegaard plays it into Marino, not to be confused. And then Jovic comes in, he tries to sweat it across, somehow blocks that one, and then he blocks the rebound as well. So we have to be a little bit more patient. Odegaard plays a fantastic ball into Chamberlain, making a brilliant run, and he finesses it. Bottom right corner with 3-1 up. But there's still 30 minutes left in this game, so we have to try and hold it out. And now we skip forward to the 80th minute. You can see our opponent is attacking. He passes the ball away. He pauses it. He manages to win the ball back on the interception, but he boots it straight out of touch. And he rage quits and we win our first online game of FIFA 21. Fantastic start and pretty fantastic uh, game from us. As you can see in the second half, it was all one way traffic. He didn't have any other shots um, in the second half. Because the 4 3 3 flat worked so well, we decided to switch that for the second game. So I had to go out and get another centre midfielder. I decided Saul would, good, would be a good card. All of his stats are above 70 apart from pace. Um, to rectify that, we went and got ourselves an engine chem style, so that boosts that pace. The dribbling, which seems to be really important, and obviously the passing, because we need to uh, well be playing those through balls from midfield. So we managed to get that. And then what we do is, so we're going to change out Odegaard, because for me, I found Odegaard as the centre midfielder did not work. His five-star skill moves are nice, but I don't use skills enough, and that two-star weak foot really, really lets him down. So I felt we'd be much more solid if we had Sawal on the left side of midfield. We had Moreno in the middle and then we have Chamberlain out on that right hand side. Nice balanced midfield. We've got one D, one centre mid that's going to be acting a bit more like a defensive midfielder. And then uh, we've got Sawal and Chamberlain acting more as the box to box players. As you see there, four star weak foot's very nice as well. So nice card. We get into our second game. And what will be the last one of this video? We're only going to play the two placement games in this one. We'll play our next three in the next video. Um, a very, very nice squad. Muller at centre forward is very nice. The two wingers are great. Brant, Chan are also fantastic midfielders. Witzel, very, very 
good DM and that back line was nice as well. And Trap caused us quite a lot of problems in this game. As you can see, we start off here. We managed to get a nice little through ball down the wing um, and get in behind with a nice little step over. We managed to go to touch. We tried to get the pass in though and he manages to intercept it with Witzel. And that's what I mean. Solid, solid CDM. He will get in there. We managed to re-intercept it. I, I tried to cut back on my left foot. I feel like I should have just tried to blast it near post. But he manages to deal with the, the press and he passes it out. And that is the end of that early attack. We now skip forward to the 26th minute. We've got another attack with Salah down the right-hand side, but his keeper comes rushing out and it goes out for a corner. I think that was a decent opportunity, but I think it would have been difficult to do anything from it. We tried to play it short again on the corner, but uh, we managed to lose out the ball and unfortunately nothing manages to happen. Um, and thankfully we managed to hold it off. We get to the end of the half and you can see here, he is charging forwards. It's a 3v4. Our back line is back, but our DMs are not there. Trent manages to do excellently to shepherd the ball out and give away a corner. Um, he plays a long ball to the back of the box. I wasn't expecting it because he hadn't switched to the man himself. Normally they switch to the player. Does a nice piece of dribbling, takes a finesse shot from outside the box. And I thought at the time that that was going in. Thankfully, it does not. We send our players long because I think from the other two goal kicks, we've been calling it short and he'd been reading onto it. So we mixed it up a bit, tried to clear it long. Unfortunately, it's Brandt versus um, the Ox and we lose out. And he begins to attack again. As you can see, the clock is now at, it's done the one minute extra that we have. And he's playing it through. Trent fails to clear it. He gets the ball. He crosses it in. Long manages to clear it with a fantastic diving header but it means he's got another corner and the mess that ensues here nearly gave me uh well i was i was panicking there you can see i i want it i cleared it i want it again i cleared it and he boots it into me and i still don't win it there you go it was a really tight first half really close and the second half was not any different it was still really, really tight. We have a good opportunity here with Saul. Get the ball into him, but he blocks it. I managed to get the ball on the left foot with Chamberlain, and then he blocks it again, and unfortunately, Salah is offside here. Um, but we get to the 70th minute. We've got an attack um, here. We're passing it around nicely, pinging it between our attackers and our midfielders. Salah makes a run out wide. That leaves space in the middle. Saul moves over. Jovic through. Jovic through to Saul. Uh, Saul does a lovely step over into Chamberlain and he puts it so far wide. I was fuming. That was the chance of the game. So we change back to the 4-2-3-1. Saul comes off for Torreira. We bring Jovetic off for Martinez, put Salah up top and we bring on Lucas Moura in the cam position. Skip forward a few minutes here, and from the goal kick, he is attacking us. We managed to win the ball, but it bounces back to him. Promise there's a lovely piece of dribbling here to be our left back. Thankfully for us, the pass was terrible, and Guedes picks up the ball here. Lucas Moore with a lovely turn and a fantastic through ball to Martinez, and we are through. We have Salah in the middle. He commits the man. That leaves us open for the sweat, and Salah taps the ball into the back of the net to give us that 1-0 lead that we so desperately required. And here we are in the 90th minute now. And it's the last part of the game. He's attacking as Torreira manages to cut the ball out. Long plays it out to Guedes. Guedes plays a short ball into Moreno. Moreno then plays a through ball to try to go down the wing. We're going to try to run it into the corner. I tap through ball because I thought Salah was going to be onside, but it was off. We just kick out the goalie. You can see we're now well over the time limit. He kicks the ball out wide and the referee blows the full time whistle, giving us our second win from two games. Fantastic start to division rivals. Um, in the next video, we'll play our last three placement games and try and get to division two, I believe it is, if you win all of them. So I'm going to leave that video here. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Ben Rinch and I'll catch you all next time.